You're watching Psyched Radio. I'm with Gary on Kids. Your host is Kevin. Can I? Can you all introduce yourselves? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I'm uh, Rojo. I'm the bass player in Karen Kids. Uh, here at Psyched Radio. Hi, uh, I'm Miguel. I shout in Karen Kids. Hello, Mauricio from Karen Kids. Um, a guitar player and producer. Stuff. Uh, I'm Victor. <laughs> I'm the drummer of the band uh, the, with the hands like broken. <laughs> I think it's easy to, if you listen to Carrie and Kids, it's pretty easy how the drummer might injure their hand. Your energy it seems very high. And, uh, what, how would you describe your, your music and your sound? Um, yeah, it's fast, um, dark. Furious. Uh, <laughs> Fast and Furious. Fast and Furious. <laughs> yeah, and you know, it's mostly like we yeah. try to play to the old punk energy uh, and uh, really keep it up a bit. We just try to uh, get that energy that we like to see from, from other bands. Mm -hmm. And uh, I guess that's what we get inspired to do when we are trying to think of our sound and our energy life, like what would we like to see ourselves? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And with Mexico City being such a big city for rock and punk, right. are there any specific bands that you really, uh, any of you grew up you know, listening or growing or listening to together as a band? Right. Yeah. Like, well, we, the, uh, the cool part of Current Kids is the each of us has different influences and yeah. we mix it all together and this is the result of the many different things we like but there's many bands we like in common you know like classic old pop bands we're all into that also like newer bands and and uh, bands of friends you know like as you said uh, in Mexico City we enjoy a lot I don't know like Los Angeles Rockets Mm -hmm. San Pedro Cortez, Sgt. Peppers, there's tons of bands that we like and we share stage with. Yeah, I'm gonna Yeah, that well, um, I want to add the Bella Lugo Yeah, sure. so cool friends. Yeah. yeah, there's some bands that, um, which we grew up um, like a band, you know, um, with people that have passed. Person, so <laughs> so I, I had another uh, influences. So, but I, I I'm enjoying this trip with Karen kids, and yeah, it's cool. <laughs> <laughs> and you're the most recent member of the band, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, coming on three years now. About three years. About three years. And have you played in any other bands before Karen kids, or is this your First, uh, you know, big goal. It, it it can be called like, uh, uh, it can be like my first band like in in, in this formal form. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, well, I, I I've been playing since I had I have six. So uh, yeah, I, I I'm enjoying this 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 ride, <laughs> and and um, yeah. I, Probably it could be my first band, like on a very high level. Right. Thank you. And going back to the music community in Mexico City, you have a. Can you tell me about your radio show there? Oh yeah. Um, well, <laughs> Monkey View Radio is um, Miguel over here, Yasmin, our manager, and um, well, me. <laughs> no, no, no. We just have fun and play the crazy stuff we would like to hear on the radio. Like uh, it's so fun because it's only our like personal um, choice that we like to share with everybody, and we just try to make it as crazy and weird and wacky as possible. And and it really 
uh, I guess, translates to the whole energy we like to give out to people and they uh, have such uh, great uh, feedback with us from that energy. It's becoming like an interaction with the audience every time and we've got to, we've got to meet so much amazing uh, talent, so many awesome bands and people from different uh, backgrounds and also like um, not only musicians but like uh, artists in many different uh, you know uh, we've gotten some cool photographers over there or like illustrators so yeah we try to give uh, a cool space for people in the like um, Mexican uh, underground scene to have some fun that's it yeah, Monkey Ray. Right. <laughs> Miguel, what do you have to say about Monkey Ray? Well, we just basically record our party. <laughs> it's like having beers with your friends, listening to music, the music you like, and that's basically what we do. Like have fun and put good music with friends, with different friends and with different influences. That's what we love to do. <laughs> Absolutely. Could you, going back to the fan interactions, has anybody, a fan or somebody in the crowd, ever thrown anything at either of you as a gift or maybe they were upset about something? <laughs> I mean, there's been some like booze thrown into the stage, but like yeah. nothing too crazy, you know? So, like um, beer cups or. Yeah. It always happens, so you gotta be you gotta be ready. And it's crazy because, you know, you can't really see anything when you look into the crowd because of the lights. So you're really just playing blind, and it can, you know, you gotta learn how to dog that kind of stuff. <laughs> it's part of it, you know. But um, yeah, nothing too crazy so far, and I hope it doesn't happen. <laughs> We're just trying to play some music, not to play. <laughs> I remember once in a house party, we were playing with Los Honey Rockets, uh, I think Las Pipas de La Paz too, and some of the friends from other city, and there was a guy like, completely wasted, and he was very stupid. And he was like messing with my pedals and oh. shouting machine, and like he was very aggressive, so. We almost got into a fight while we were playing. That would be fun, but yeah. it didn't happen. <laughs> yeah. But, I mean, I'm cool with that. It's better like that. <laughs> but, yeah, sometimes you can have crazy people trying to mess with you. <laughs> yeah, I think it's more like that. Uh, the people who used to get up the stage and take the microphone or <laughs> try to... <laughs> try to play the guitar and that kind of stuff and they used to like um, unplug the yeah. pedals or <laughs> they do stupid things but it's great it's for the show and so it's the energy it's the energy yeah so it's energy that you're not the happiest about but you understand it's there and you know, you're all happy to provide the energy for it. well no um Honestly, I'm I'm so glad when that happens. Like yeah, somebody totally, totally. knocks me over and they like take the guitar and they like kick the amps or the drums. I'm so happy with that. That's what we want, actually. You know, that's what we like to see. We the crazier the better. You know, burn the place up. That's that's why we do what we do. It's it's gotta be a huge party. Like never mind the set list. Never mind the songs. Like it's it's all about like. Let's make it as big and loud as we possibly can. You know? Yeah, yeah. That's hilarious. <laughs> yeah. Have you, uh, and you play a uh, guitar, right? Yep. Have either of you ever gone into crowd while playing and kind of attracted fans that way? <laughs> attracted with them on that level? Well, uh, yeah, we have like some great fan interactions. Like people that are always so excited to be there, and whenever we see some big energy out there somebody like trying to I don't know call us out on something or just like um, acting for fun or like somebody some new friends we meet out there it's like um, it's always cool it's always cool we, we I don't know 
Like, what's so crazy in direction? Like, <laughs> uh, I don't know. Like, um, once you 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 took away uh, a fan's team. Oh yeah, <laughs> we're playing in France, in Paris, and the crowd was completely oh, right. crazy, and I jumped out of stage and it became an incredible party but the mosh pit was so crazy that a, uh, a guy just knocked, knocked his tooth with me yeah. with my guitar <laughs> yeah. I didn't care like he was bleeding and <laughs> jumping and spitting blood everywhere and I was like okay <laughs> cool <laughs> the, the, craziest, the punkest person I've seen in my life maybe right yeah. And yeah, that inspired us a lot. <laughs> a lot of fun that night. <laughs> yeah. Absolutely. Hopefully, we can uh, catch some of that energy here at Eli's uh, today at yeah, Psych Radio. Yeah, we, oh. uh, I mean, absolutely. We do. We do. <laughs> absolutely. At Eli's Mile High Club, Psych Radio SF. Uh, right. Get yeah. on, kids. Yeah, come down and get crazy with us, people. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. And We'll see how we survive this night. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks so much uh, for listening to us. Yeah, thank you.